Bunked. Have you ever seen Bunked? No. Nope. Not great. Uh, do you ever seen the cat undercover chick thing? I don't, like, maybe, but D. Like, no, I don't remember it. I Carly S tier. Um, the Proud Family. I was gonna say, is that The Proud Family? I always, I mean, I never liked that show. I never enjoyed it. To be honest. Where put a D tier? It had its moments. Danny Phantom. S tier. S tier. Rugrats, F tier. Oh, oh dear. Never seen. I don't know what that is. So, Dragon Josh, S tier. I don't care. There's the kid with the chalk. Where's the kid with the chalk? The next one. This one? Yep. I don't remember it at all, so you have to Bro, rank it. A or B for sure. What could I it mean, be? B. Girl Meets World, terrible. It's like a worse version of Boy Meets World. Yeah. Um, All Grown Up, that's Rugrats again, but I haven't seen that version. Loud House? Loki A tier. Honestly, it's kind of funny. Hey Arnold, I never F-tier. watched. F tier. Just throw it. Lily and Maddie, F tier. Sunny with a chance. I feel like it never really got a chance, you know? <laughs> kind of maybe B. Kind of like Demi, Demi at Lotto Life. Kind of got <laughs> hooked on drugs. Yeah, I feel like she's kind of the reason we never got to see it to its full potential. Yeah. Something about her and drugs. She, she really Phineas likes him. Phineas and Ferb, make an S plus, brother. Phineas and Ferb is... <laughs> it's just next level. Yeah, there's there's Phineas S. Phineas and Ferb is on, I'm watching it. There's S and then there's S plus. And uh, as much as I love the S rated shows in here... If you had here, a Drake and Josh episode and a Phineas and Ferb episode on, which one are you turning on? Nostalgia wise, I'm turning on Drake and Josh. But like right now, and but so it's like okay. But if I were to Drake sit down, Drake is doing something, and then Doctor Doofenshmirtz is doing something. Yeah, Doctor, Doctor, yeah. or Barry the Platypus. Honestly, I think Ant Farm was wildly underrated. I give it a B. I give it an A. Lizzie McGuire, awful. Shake it up, awful. That's so. That's Raven. So so random or whatever. This? So random is not at all related. To okay, so never seen it. That's so Raven. I have seen honestly mid. Fill the future. I never saw. I didn't know they made a show that. off of Emperor's New Groove. They sure did. Yeah, it's on for a while. Hannah Montana was pretty goaded. I mean, I'd probably put it on like Carly's level. Ah, uh, no, I think I Carly's better. Zoe one hundred and one. I'm gonna get a lot of hate here. Where are you gonna put it? Like I TV? don't think it's good. So good. I only watched it for that smart little blonde kid. Uh, never seen that. Big Time Rush was terrible. Victorious. Dude, Big Time Rush, low key, kind of no. hilarious. Victorious was kinda great. Hilarious. It never reaches potential. No, dude, Victorious. I've good. never seen Victorious that. Victorious is S. Never seen that. Oh, great. I thought you were going to argue with me. Um, Jesse is B tier. Had some good parts. Cat Dog, I never saw. I don't know what that is. Don't know what that is. I don't know what recess is. That looks like a baby attacking a town. Never seen that. Austin and Alley was trash. Don't at me. And then if you thought Austin and Alley was a good show, you're stupid. Same with Ned. Ned School D class. That show was ass. He, I mean, I put it on Raven's level at least. SpongeBob is S. SpongeBob is S plus. If you don't agree with that, you probably didn't have fun parents growing up, and you probably weren't allowed to watch it. Um, I I I'm skipping ahead a couple because I can see it. So the Fred show. Absolutely F. do not watch. That. I don't know what that is. I've seen the ta- Teenage Robot, but like just parts of it. I've never uh, actually watched teenage it. Teenage Robot. Fairly Odd Parents. S plus. S plus. For sure. Now, now, we're also going to say, I'm going to put a, like a Disclaimer. parenthesis around this. Nothing where he has to share the stupid fairies. The only thing, the like, honestly, just end it after Poof was born. Because Poof was good, but then anything after that was honestly just depressing to the entire franchise. And they changed the theme song, so it, it might as well be a different show. Not gonna lie though, I watched some of the new ones. They're not bad. No, they're terrible. 
Um, I don't know what that is. Henry Danger is not bad, but it's not great. Henry Danger is low key funny. Fish Hooks is a D. Wizards of Waverly Place is gonna be S tier for me. I, I I agree. I think it's great. That's ahead of its time. Honestly. And there's not really anything like it. You know, a lot of these are all similar, but they're wizards. <laughs> you know, Good Luck Charlie I think was a good show. Solid A T. Dude, Henry Danger. Low key good show. No. But I definitely put it above. Sweet Life of Zack and Cody Charlie. is an S tier immediately, in my opinion. Yeah, I would agree. Dog with a blog I never saw. Commercials were funny. This looks like a Tangled show. Never seen it. Kim Possible. S. I'm between S and A. Meaning S tier and A tier. Dude, it's not on Ant Farms level. It's definitely above Ant Farms. You're right. It's above all of these. Also, I'm gonna make a make a decision here. Oh my god. I'd watch these Loud three. House, I would turn on all the time before all three. I would watch these three before I watch Loud House for sure. Uh, Jimmy Neutron. S tier. Um, and then I didn't do it. I've never heard of. Wait, is this? Okay, no, I thought that was a different show. So I think this is a solid list for sure. You can really tell what I watched. Yeah, you definitely can. Cartoons and the shows that everybody else watched. But there's a reason everyone else watched them. But you didn't like Zoe 101. No. Zoe 101 Bro, was trash. Big Time Rush, low-key hilarious. No. With the show. The show. To be fair, a lot of these shows people love. Um, but they're terrible. Jesse, I would knock down a peg just for the theme song. Hey, Jesse! Ant Farm was not good. Ant Farm was good. Ant Farm was not good. Ant Farm was funny. It was just like that room that they always had class in and then the hallway. And that was basically that show. Yeah, but that's a lot of these shows. <laughs> like, think of iCarly. The apartment. The, the apartment. They, they had her room later. They had the hallway that, outside the apartment. They had Freddie's apartment. So they, they had, had Ned's you, house. You just Neville's named. House. You just named the apartment about six but they times. They had the room and the hallway in Ant Farm. The school hallway with the stairs in the background. And the room that they were stuck in. Wizards of Waverly Place. They had the substation. They had the room. They had the room they did magic in. They had. Dude, the it's school. the same place though. But it's different sets. Sweet Life of Zack and Cody. Set. They had their room. They, they had, had any the other room. They, they had, had the hotel. The they, they had, had the hotel. They had the lobby. They had school. They had... Like, come on, man. They even went to a Yankees Red Sox game. Victorious. Her house. Oh, my gosh. The RV they were stuck There's in. There's no winning this battle. The school. The cafeteria. The outside place where they had... They ate food. See, I feel like you just know these because you watched it more. No. Nah. But can you tell me another set on Ant Farm? No. Exactly. I just remember liking exactly. it. Exactly. I mean, Drake and Josh only had like three. School, house, premiere. The parking lot where he hit Oprah. Oh my god. You're naming... Their room, the kitchen. You're naming room. one scene at like... Meg's, Megan's room, the hallway outside. That's Megan's their room, house. The school. You, you, this is Hafer's classroom. You are... The detention classroom. You're naming specific episodes is the problem. No, 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 no. 